Here is a quick description of the cosplay. A Max for Live device that uses waveforms to generate MIDI sequences for your MIDI instruments. These two waveforms have seven different function curves that frequency modulate each other to create a third wave, which is the MIDI sequence to the right of this display. So like FM synths, you could call this an FM sequencer. All right, so I'll just kind of zero this out to kind of show you the, the waves that we got going on. So this is uh, cosine. We've got seven different ones, and it uh, smoothly transitions into a sine wave and then into a tangent and then an arc tangent. And then there's uh, three different ease functions, and the first is back, and then it goes to elastic, and then all the way to bounce. And so you have these two different waves that are going to be frequency modulating one another. This is a uh, nice little button for just generating random uh, frequencies of both sides. So these are the curves, and then these are the, uh, the frequency of that. Um, and then we have a gain of that. So this can kind of control the way that the, um, these melody lines are created. And this is a nice little fine tune. So if you wanted to find something that you, or you, you find something that you like, and then you want to just kind of tweak it a little bit, this is a nice little parameter. This can move the uh, sequences up or down as well. It zeroes it out, and this makes it a little bit smaller, compresses it. Uh, this is a start point, so you can put this anywhere. You can go up to 64 steps, so you can get a super long sequence if you want. And uh, moving on to the step sequencer part of the device. This is the interpretation of the waves into MIDI steps. So let's get a sequence going. So we can mute some of these notes, and we can also sustain. And then over here, we can actually do the same thing where we limit the notes that are being triggered. And then quickly as well, you can just flip and do the inverse, and so it will only take the notes above and below. I really like this function for being able to kind of have a melody that you like and get quick variations and uh, deviate from the melody in subtle ways that still connect everything, but then also make something new from that. And so now that we have a melody that we like, we can make a clip. And then with this, we um, can make many clips and come up with different variations and just save them all. And this is great because then you can use this plugin to make many different melodies and just save them for later. And this can also be used to trigger MIDI clips. And I didn't want to make this plugin too complicated. I think that having too many parameters and having too many things that you can manipulate can really slow down the creative process. And I wanted something that was relatively simple um, in concept and execution, but also kind of gave you enough variation and repeatability so that you can have a lot of fun and be as creative as possible. Well, that should get you started. Thanks a lot. I hope you enjoy. Thank you.